What are these two Shabar J in? Pops, what it do? And from that to this juvenile, juvenile. your music. 400 degrees. How old was you when you first heard him? When I first heard him, I was probably 98, 98, 97. What'd you like, 17? <laughs> 16, 15. He been out that long? Yeah. And when did he, when did he first drop this, that instrumental? I think that's 99. Okay, that's I want to say it's 99. So you really wouldn't want him to re rap on it because he might mess it up. I mean, no, nah, he just gonna play. He nah, he ain't gonna mess this up. Oh, so he's not gonna change it. Gonna, it shouldn't be the same. It's gonna be. It sound like it was the same. Yeah. Oh. He ain't gonna mess this song up. This might be just like a storyline. Oh, he's from Louisiana. Was he in? Uh, he's from uh, New Orleans. Yeah. He with Cash Money. Yeah. Hot Boy, Lil Wayne, BG, Lil Turk. What you think the best era, the best decade? I was around for a few of them. Yeah. Been around for four of them. I'm going to go with uh, T.I. and the Juvenile. Not two, not Juvenile, but T.I., Jeezy. What was that like? Young Jock, 2000. 2001. I said the best last one. I don't know. 10, 2010 to 2020. Mm-hmm. Now you got Lil Wayne in your class. I'm talking about Lil Wayne, Daddy. You got Jay-Z. I mean, you could yeah. put them in that... From like 2010 to 2013. Yeah, you can. If you think about it, because when uh, Carter, Carter, uh, when he dropping them Carter uh, well, Carter was coming out 09. The last Carter, I want to say. Carter 3, Carter 4. Nah, look, my, yeah, probably. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm about to look it up. No, no. Don't, don't quote me on that one. 98. Oh, yeah, the album called 400 Degrees. Yeah. Think about it. Back then, they were selling copies, four million copies. Imagine a dollar a copy. That's four million dollars just off a dollar. Off of that, yeah. And they, they was how much was they? Was it? Like now, if you got them that first day, they were nine dollars. But then and they sold four million. They were seventeen dollars like in two weeks. What's the math on that? Nine, nine times, nine times four nine. What's the math? That's thirty-six million dollars. And then he get like I said, he get a dollar off each copy. Oh, he get a dollar off each copy. Yeah, he get a dollar off each copy. Oh, he was already signed with somebody at this time? It was Cash Money. With, with Birdman. What y'all call him? This Birdman, visual, baby? This oh. visual is a... This visual is a celebration of the 25th anniversary of Monumental Achievement. Oh, this is probably the worst time. Saying this song 25 years old? Yeah. 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 You see me, I eat your sleep shit and talk rap. You see that 98 Mercedes on TV, I bought that. I had some belly and charges, I bought that. Been sent to no return, but still was bought back. Bigger do some slacks in the water, y'all caught that. I put it in the bitch before they could call Jack. Now I'm looking for that belly and pot to walk back. If I ain't a hot boy, then what do you call that? Nigga, disrespect me, I'ma be in all black. Coming was he in that, um, that group with Lil Wayne? Yeah. The hot boys? Yeah. What, um, he was in Block is Hot? Yeah. I don't even think I remember hearing it. This, about, this go hard, though. Bag that thing. This is probably his best song. song. Yeah, this is his best song. Yeah. yeah. This is his best song. Them the bitches before they can call Jack. Now I'm looking for that family, your pot is the wall back. If I ain't a hot boy, then what do you call that? Nigga, just respect me. All they beats. Oh, he's a DJ. All they beats, yeah. Wait, so what Birdman is a rapper? Yeah. Yeah, Birdman is a rapper. 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 Yeah, Birdman is a yeah, I'm being all black, coming in by some niggas about killing and all that. Be Corey and Rusty and Duck Dog. Ride top down so we let the trucks pause. MMT riding 4D. I'm moving up at these niggas claiming they know me. Uh, uh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> probably because I'm younger, that's probably why. Bitch, what? I'll bust it. Yeah, kind of, kind of. He named his album 500 Degrees. Juvenile left the group first. Uh huh. And then Lil Wayne dropped the 500 Degrees album. Trying to. They still cool now, or no? Yeah. <laughs> Not really. I don't think they hate each other, but I think they, they trying to get this money, trying to get back together and make this money, though. They could do a good tour. That'd yeah, they trying. That'd go crazy. Bitch, what? I'll bust your ass up. Don't even go that water because I'm ready to mass up. I heard about the money. That's a nice change. For the right price, I'll bust the right brain. Oh, nigga, try. I 
can do the right thing. Only God knows what the future might bring. Nigga might be shot, nigga might be trifling. Nigga might survive if he bought that right flame. What's up? That'll stop a nigga from playing. Something like a child walk with dead in his hand. Boy, look, nigga don't play no games no more. Nigga will bust your head if you bang his hole. Attitude adjustments that y'all need. My calling door enforcement. Nigga call me. I bet you I get them niggas off your block. I bet you I show them niggas this boy hot. Sounded, it stopped. It, it went right before this. The whole same. This is ain't nothing changed. Ain't nothing changed. Everything. That was in the Hummers, right back in the day, right? But if you really sit back and, I mean, this beat is cool. But like this little part right here, if you really sit back and close your eyes and listen to it, it's really trash. <laughs> like, if you really just sit back and just listen to it, uh-uh. it's just not a good of a beat. Like right now, this ain't doing nothing. That's cause that's cause it's twenty five years old. This a bad. So back then that was hard. Yeah. This beat like if, like when hard. when the when the bass thumping is good, but like that little part right. The, the, yeah, the, if you really think about that, so. that's the core. I feel like I could do that. Literally. Right. <laughs> All his albums did good back in the day. All his albums. So what would he be like if you if you was in like nineteen ninety six to like two thousand two? What would you rank him in the like like top five rappers or top ten? Like would you even put him in the top ten? You said from ninety seven from from ninety five to like two thousand three. Ninety five. We still talking about Tupac and Biggie alive. So he's not he's not in top ten rappers at that time. Not from ninety five. What about ninety seven? Ninety seven to two thousand. 97 to 2000. Still ain't like in the top 10. So, he never, so basically, he never in the top 10. He top, he top 20. Back, back then? Back then, he was better than Lil Wayne back then. Okay. He was better than Lil Wayne back then. I ain't do it. I hate to do you like that. Wait, when did uh, Tupac die? I thought he was dead Tupac before. died in 96. Dang. So, if, you, if you're if you going back to 95, and then Biggie died in 97, but you still had Snoop Dogg. You think Tupac will be big on music right now, or you think he'll be a he'd bigger be, he'd actor? Be a, you think he'll be an actor or a bigger? Be a like that. You think so? Yeah. I think so, probably. He'd be a politician. I think he probably would have sure. been one. Nah, he'd been a politician for sure. He would have been done rapping a long time. Ago. Yeah. That's why people like he number one. I, I can't put him in number one. I, I, I feel like he wouldn't have went too far with music as he got older, because he was already turned into a, a actor and all the other stuff. Well, see, you got to think about it. The boy was 25 years old, and the stuff he was talking about? Yeah. Way above his time. Yeah. He knew too much. Yeah, maybe he knew too much. Too gangster though. He should just. Why they did? Why people did more gangster when they did popping? We 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 do reaction on pop. We do we do one on pop. I'm gonna get blood on my people like a clown. The G goes to be a buy and we die by. The book is what we never will abide by. Niggas drive by, get loose, beefing with each other like a checkerboard. Nigga moves with them in Compton. Otherwise, nigga.
Cash Money though. Uh, who, who else was uh, Cash Money with Master P? Who? Uh, he didn't have no mystical. Was probably the biggest. Yeah, I don't know thing. what that is. Soldier Swim, Snoop Snoop Kane, Dr. Wild, uh, Silk Fiend, Mac, Mill X, C Murder. I got that. That was a gang. Them niggas. They were dropping music every week. It sounded like uh, my boys is better. Master P set the tone, and then Cash Money ran off with it. Yeah, yeah. you it can did. say you can say because they still relevant now. You got Drake, you yeah. got Nicki Minaj. Yeah, yeah. So y'all want us that. to react to any more old music? Just put it in the comments, and we'll react to it. Get this video to 100 likes. Subscribe if y'all don't subscribe. Did we finna hit 5K? Love y'all. Appreciate y'all.